Hey, you guys, my name is Yasmin Suri, and I'm doing a video today about C-H-I-N-A creating a sun. And this is so important for these end times that you guys just have to follow me on this video. We are in the end times. The Bible clearly says in Isaiah 14, 12 through 14, how you have fallen from heaven, O Lucifer, son of the morning, how you are cut down to the ground, you who weakened the nations. For you have said in your heart, I will ascend into heaven. I will exalt my throne above the stars of God. I will also sit on the mount of the congregation on the farthest sides of the north. I will ascend above the heights of the clouds. I will be like the most high. What are we dealing with right now? Satan is called the counterfeiter. He cannot be, be God. He is the God of this world, but he wants to be God himself. He is not the creator, okay? Only God is the creator. So what is he trying to do? He's trying to counterfeit God's creation and create the moons and the stars and people and the list goes on, but the stars and the sun, he's trying to create a sun through C-H-I-N-A. Watch this. Chinese scientists have created an artificial sun. And the latest experiment in the man-made sun project saw it run for 20 minutes at 70 million degrees. Sorry, I've lost seven. It's five Please. times hotter than the real sun. A city in China has a bright idea, as in eight times brighter than the moon. China wants to launch a fake moon into the sky by the year 2020. Announced last week at an innovation conference. Get this. It's actually a satellite that would reflect the sun's rays at night. It will reportedly be eight times brighter than the real moon and could replace streetlights. However, astronauts are concerned about the increased light pollution it could cause. But wait, there's more. <laughs> this is crazy. China has also just taken nuclear technology to a whole new level by flipping the switch for the first time ever on a new fusion reactor it's called the T T Tacoma Reactor. This thing is so powerful, it it's literally being called an artificial sun because it creates a powerful magnetic field that fuses hot plasma to reach temperatures of more than 150 million degrees Celsius, which is said to be, oh, 10 times hotter than the core of the sun. Today, we learn that they've made a new sun, indeed 10 times hotter than the core of the sun through a fusion technique which produces no waste, cannot be stolen and misused by anybody else. Time will tell on what unfolds here, but I think a lot of other countries around the world will be watching China very closely and China's really trying to lead the world here and set its mark by creating this artificial sun and setting up, you know, creating this technology that will lead the world. But I think a lot of people will be watching. Chinese scientists have created an artificial sun. Okay, you guys, this is serious stuff. This is end time stuff. These are things that the Lord warned us about. The Lord has clearly warned us. Satan wants to be like the most high God. He wants to be the creator. He wants to ascend above the stars, ab above the skies. He wants to create. He wants to be worshipped. He wants to be honored. He wants to take the place of God. He is a counterfeiter. He is trying to create God's creation that only God can create. We are in the end times. Even the Bible says in the last days that even the Antichrist causes 
fire to come down from heaven. Satan wants the power that only God has. So I wanted to share with you also that this is set to be the world's largest nuclear nuclear. This is supposed to be the world's largest nuclear. <laughs> this is supposed, this is supposed, you guys, this is serious. This is supposed to be the world's largest nuclear reactor and the product of collaboration between 35 countries, including every state in the European Union, the UK, China, India, and the US. ITER contains the most powerful magnet, making it capable of producing, listen, listen, you guys, this is serious, a magnetic field 280,000 times strong as one around the earth live science previously reported you guys this is serious the fusion reactor is expected to come online in 2025 but they already tested it this month january okay it will uh, you guys this is wake up we're at the end times this is it The Bible clearly says in the book of Revelation, Revelation 8, 10 through 11, and the third angel sounded and there fell a great star from heaven, burning as it were a lamp. And it fell upon the third part of the rivers and upon the fountains. And the name of the star is called Wormwood, which means bitter. And the third part of the waters became warm wood and many men died of the waters because they were made bitter. I don't know what that is, but I have a sneaking suspicion that this has to do with the nuclear capabilities of creating a sun in the sky that they'll even be able to control not only the heat, but also create a sun and also create control the weather patterns and even cause it to rain. They are working on this. This is real. This is not fake. This is highly monitored just to let you guys know that. Jesus even said that the Antichrist is even, even going to cause fire to come down from heaven. We know that we're in the end times and there will be counterfeit, lying, signs, wonders, and miracles. And the Bible says in the book of Revelation that the entire inhabitants of the earth were deceived by these signs and wonders that the Antichrist performs. This nuclear artificial fusion experiment is world news. This is not fake news this is real news and this is something that the world is in for this is nuclear power and this is unprecedented what is happening so again more than 10,000 chinese and foreign scientific researchers have worked together to bring to life the artificial sun the East harness is extremely high temperatures to boil hydrogen isotopes into plasma, fusing them together and releasing energy. Five years from now, we will start to build our fusion reactor, which will need another 10 years of construction. This was already beginning years ago. They are getting ready. So as of January 6th of this year, China switched on its artificial sun and burned it five times hotter than our actual sun. This is end time stuff, you guys. This is something that God has warned us about over and over again, that we are in the end times. And the whole agenda of this is to counterfeit God's power. 
It is a satanic agenda that is being used by men and Satan controls this earth. He is called the prince of the power of the air, the spirit that now works in the children of disobedience. He is the little God of this world and he desires to be God. He desires to be like the most high God and to create men that desire to be like the most high God that built the tower of Babel in the old Testament. Now we're at an incredible unprecedented speed and power that people are being used by Satan to create what Satan wants. He wants to mock God. He wants to counterfeit his power, which he never will, but he's going to use the very power that he counterfeits to destroy human lives that are created in God's image and his likeness. We are all God's creation, but we are not all of his children. So this is the purpose of that. This is going to be used to destroy God's creation, but also to mock God and to be like God, Satan and his cohorts, to, to, to counterfeit everything that God is. This is just one of the many ways he's doing it. The Bible clearly says in 2 Thessalonians 2, 9 through 12, God says the coming of the lawless one is by the activity of Satan with all power and false signs and wonders with all wicked deception for those who are perishing because they refuse to love the truth and so be saved. God sends them a strong delusion. People are going to be falling for the devil's power. They're going to be falling for the false signs and wonders. In Revelation 12, 9, the Bible says, and the great dragon was thrown down, that ancient serpent who is called the devil and Satan, the deceiver of the whole world. He was thrown down to earth and his angels were thrown down with him. Revelation 13, it performs great signs, even making fire to come down from heaven to earth in front of people. And by the signs that it is allowed to work in the presence of the beast, it deceives those who dwell on the earth, telling them to make an image for the beast that was wounded by the sword and yet lived. We are in the end times, you guys. This is not the time to be deceived. Revelation 16, and I saw coming out of the mouth of the dragon and out of the mouth of the beast and out of the mouth of the false prophet, they're counterfeiting the Trinity. Satan is a great counterfeiter. Three unclean spirits like frogs, for they are demonic spirits performing signs who go abroad to the kings of the world to assemble them for the battle on the great day of God, the Almighty. That is the at the Valley of Megiddo or the, uh, the, or the Battle of Armageddon. So we are getting ready. You guys, time to wake up. Watch my next video. You're going to want to hear this one too.